So, once again I'm taking apart my shotgun. This time it's to install this custom magazine we built. We saw this at eHobby Asia. It was a modification so you could put an M4 Max. But it was kind of pricey for the piece of plastic that it was. So we decided to make it ourselves. And the reason I'm taking apart my shotgun is you need to remove this part right here. And that's pretty easy. However, with this stock, it was kind of hard. This is the screwdriver we had to use. And we had to go around the hose here. But that aside, you need to take this part away because otherwise the magazine won't fit. So here it is, our custom magazine holder for M4 Max. When you put in the mag, the BBs will automatically feed through this tube and will push into the nozzle. The nozzle has, uh, has to do no work, just has to stand there, the BBs will feed through automatically. So I'll never have to guess if the shotgun is loaded or not because I'll know that there are BBs inside. Also we decided to make it ourselves because the price for the one on eHobby Asia was a little bit too much for the piece of plastic that it was. And besides we have a lot of 3D printers around here where we live so we printed one out ourselves. We're gonna show you the schematics in a minute. And yeah we uh, sent it off and we got this. So here are the schematics, we just worked around the standard M4 mag, made sure it would uh, fit nice and tight and put a shotgun shell on top of it so it would uh, fit into place. So the BBs will just follow the path up, up through the shotgun shell, into the nozzle and up into the shotgun barrels. But that's about it, I uh, would suggest if you're good with measuring you make your own magazine, maybe give it a little spin, something special, this is just uh, standard. But I'm gonna leave you guys here, gonna leave you with uh, another video of me shooting, hope you enjoyed it and see you in another video. Oh. Hey, Shayla, go. Nick. Echo.